Welcome to the MV Toolbox tutorial. On this tutorial, we'll learn how to work with scanned mesh models in SolidWorks. After creating a mesh model in Echo, we'll now export the mesh into STL file. When the STL file is ready, we can move to SolidWorks. To open the file we will first need to create a new part. From the MV Toolbox menu, click on Import and open the saved file. In most workstations, loading time will usually take around 1 minute for every million polygons. Aligning the model to planes. Click the Orient Mesh to align the mesh with the main planes. Define a new temporary plane by clicking on three or more points. Clicking Rotate to Top will automatically rotate the temporary plane to the top plane and will align the whole model. Next, we will repeat the process, but this time we will make to the front plane. For the last step in the alignment, we will use the Move Mesh option to manually change the mesh orientation. Many times, it is a trial and error process until we get to a perfect alignment. Creating planes and entities. To create a new plane, select three points or more. To create an entity such as a point or a line, simply click on where you want to create the entity. You can hide the mesh model by clicking on Hide Mesh, this will allow you to better see any drawing you created. Deleting and decimating the mesh. Clicking on Mesh Info will show you the number of faces your model has. To delete parts of the mesh, click on Edit Mesh and then click on any area you want to delete. To reduce the file size and the number of faces, click Edit Mesh again, and this time choose Decimate Mesh. This model has almost 5 million faces. Let's reduce that in half. Decimation takes time, allow 1 or 2 minutes for the process to end. Section Cutting and Contour Drawing Let's start by creating a plane parallel to where we want to cut our model. We'll select the plane we've just created and click on the Section tool. Next, we'll enable the Move option and manually drag our plane to where we want to cut the model.
When ready, create a drawing on the contour. Hide your model to get a better view of the drawing. Let's do that again, this time we'll use one of the main planes for our second section cut. You can save your work with the mesh model simply by saving the file, or if you want to share the file, delete the mesh and save your drawing as a SOLIDWORKS part file. For more information, we are available on email and through our website. Thank you for watching.